Good morning. Good morning. I have a today a really weak uh, my voice, but shortly I want to share with you. Please prepare the clip, clip and uh, uh, thought with what I want to share with you will be will be named called Maximum by Spirit or through Spirit. Please watch. This is wise man John Chi at the Synagogue Church of All Nations, setting the people free from every demonic bondage in their lives. The name of Jesus Christ is power and fire that makes Satan and his agents flee. Wise man John Chi encounters this lady at the prayer line and delivers her in the power of the Holy Ghost. Who are you? Who are you? A snake. You are what? I'm a snake. How long have you been in her? She's in safe palm. Since she was born. What have you done to her? Destruction! Hatred! Jesus, no relationship! She won't get married. Now come out of her! Come out! Fire! All of my body! Fire! Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ! Fire! All of my body! Out! Out! Thank you, Lord. We are the manifestation of this spirit impure. This spirit has shut the life of this woman. This spirit has destroyed her life. And he didn't want her to marry. He was out of his sight. Look here. You said you are a snake. I'm not a snake. My name is Happiness. You said you are a snake. I'm not a snake. My name is Happiness. Jesus has set you free. Thank you, Jesus. My name is Happiness. Well, oh man, the problem that brought me to the Synagogue Church of One Nation was the problem of prostituting. Actually, after watching the deliverance of my sister, I knew I needed to be delivered. Because these spirits of snake had made me to destroy it of men. Because that was the commission they gave me in the Black Sea to destroy men. And I have been doing it very, very effectively. In a day, I can sleep with nine to ten men without getting tired. I just have that power. I don't get satisfied. It's just the odds just comes. I can charm any man of my choice. Because my eyes is number one, the very first tool I use in getting them. How do I do that? Any man I look at must fall down for me. And anything I tell the man, he must do it. If I tell him I need any money, he will get that money for me. He will do virtually everything possible to get me, get, give me that money without looking back. So I've been doing it. And the worst of it is that if any man I sleep with, after sleeping with me, you will not be yourself again. You will become like a fool following me anywhere I go to. And I was doing it very, very well. If you are a married man and you are married, you have children, you will be having crisis in your family. And if you are trying to look for children, you will have low sperm count. That is it. Because we take those things to our kingdom. Very foolish of them. They will like, ah, this girl, she's so good. But they will know that they are not sleeping with an ordinary person. They are sleeping with a snake. That is what we do. So that's why I came here to be delivered. Even sometimes I was like, let me stop it on my own. But I still have that urge to go out. And, because the thing is already ringing in my head. Okay. My, my thought, uh, maximum by spirit. In our church, we pray for great revival, for great church. And... Uh, for us, really important to know, and we try to aware and make to known for everybody of the spiritual reality. Spiritual reality is, is the knowing, knowing truth. Spiritual reality exists as we are, our spirits. Beside us, there is, there is God's spirit. God, cre God create us, each, each of us, and breath his, his spirit in us, in the body which were, were created from the earth. And we became, became a living soul. And for us, really, really important to understand beside our body, our material appearance, and up, uh, substance in this world, we have spirit from God, and which are ascended by God, who Himself 
is spirit. God is spirit. And for us, really important to understand. From this clip, we clearly can see that spirit is person. It's hard to understand all things as a creation. As a creation, it's really hard for us to understand our creator. But we don't have choice. We have to accept the facts. In, uh, in this case, we can clearly see this young lady, she is a student of university. And doesn't matter how, how high in society you can have your position, you are still in the world of spirits. And uh, by herself, she couldn't do what, what she, she, she's doing. But these spirits in the book Apostle Paul wrote to Philippians chapter 2 verse 13 and he wrote over there such a things. But the God, spirit of God, create, produce within us his desires and produce his actions, works. We have to clearly understand that spirit of God or spirit of Satan, this is the person. As a person, person has his own will, desire, vision, emotion, everything. As a we are persons, spirit is person. <coughs> The morning spirit has his own passion and desire. And this and desire of satanic spirit to, destruction, to, to destruction, to deceive, to lead astray, to, to kill and destroy. On the opposite spirit of God, he is good, it is a good spirit. And it is a person with his desire. As, as a spirit, satanic spirit, let this young, beautiful girl in such a shameful uh, pattern of life, conduct of life, and leading her surroundings to the destruction and her personally. Maximum by spirit. Spirit has unquenchable, unquenchable desire to progress, to go forward to, to it, to his end goal. And goal of unclean spirit is death, destruction. I want to explain maximum with God, with the Holy Spirit. Maximum for our church, for each of us. Good maximum. On the opposite side, as demonic spirit leads people on a, on a bad Destruction maximum, Holy Spirit. That's really important for us, each of us, to know. To find connection with the Holy Spirit. To know Him. Establish a relationship with the Holy Spirit. Because Holy Spirit, on the opposite of demonic spirit, he's, he's, He has His own desire, plan vision to bring maximum of his goodness, kindness, abundance in our life. On the opposite, 
to unclean spirit. Holy Spirit has his best for us in our marriage, in our singleness, in our business, in our finances. As, as a demons try uh, wants to touch every area of human life, his health, wealth, relationship, peace, joy, happiness, every sphere of our, of our human life, and he and demons against even human will. Humanly, this beautiful lady, having degree from university, she likely uh, choose, will choose for herself good life, but on the opposite, being promoted, pushed, being possessed by invisible person, demon, he, he brought so, so much destruction in the surroundings, surround, in her surrounding, not looking on the tears of babies, wives, the, disregard everything, demons with their great passion came to kill, steal, and destroy. Maximum with spirits, with spirit. Brothers and sisters, with our own uh, power, willingness, we cannot accomplish much. But when we accept spirit of God, when we welcome the spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit has his holiness. Holiness speaks for itself. It's holy. You will be protected by holiness. People who, who, who are led uh, by, by demons on the way of sin, there is always a risk. There is always, always danger. But when you when you choose the Holy Spirit, He has His own character, He has His own desire, He has His own vision, and He reveals us His desire, vision, and He promote within promote within us His actions. He create within within us His character of holiness. So important in our earthly life to rely on spirit as a holy people, in church people. Brothers and sisters, so important. If you consider today mega churches, a mega movement of Christianity, all of them are based on a, on a spiritual entity. And a, and a spirituality. If you if you take for example Yonggicho, Yonggicho even did 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 not finish high school. If you consider Yon, uh, Prophet T. B. Joshua, this ministry w w what we watch, millions of people are, are delivered there, restored for life. On a base what? On the exceptions by the Prophet T. B. Joshua. Holy Spirit, maximum with Holy Spirit. That's why it's so important for us when in our church we pray for salvation. That's real salvation. Saving soul, we save life from drugs, alcohol, perversion, immorality, Poverty, sicknesses, confusion, uh, depression, just name it. Holy Spirit saves. He has holy desire. And he creates within, with, within, within us. That's, that's passion as he has. 
He claimed on us because we are his own. In, on the, in the beginning, when earth was empty, not demons covered around the globe, but Holy Spirit. If you, if you watch deliverance, exorcism, you clearly can see passion of demons. They don't want to leave person. Why so big passion? Why so big uh, desire to stay that evil person? If, if devil whom we, who we, who, whom we belong not has so big claim on us, we are stranger to him. But to Holy Spirit, we are his creation. Holy Spirit has his passion on you. But he cannot come in relationship with us as, as demons do. For demons, for, for devil to come in the life of person and not just enough any sin, but to have communion with the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit is a gentleman and he is looking for our willingness to yield, to yield ourselves, to, to respect him and to invite him and develop our relationship. This is my young granddaughter. She, she cannot speak. She is just five, five months old, but she is person. She is not grown yet, not developed yet as a, as a, uh, in her, her mature, maturity. Holy Spirit is person in our hearts. He can be developed through our commitment in relationship with him. And he will start produce his desire. He will start pursuing his want, his uh, vision in our hearts. And he will establish in us his work, his action to reach.